Yes. Right here. Mada. Uh-uh, Mada. Uh, English people say that. Uh-uh. Right? Yeah, we English white people. Friend. But yeah, don't you see? It's shitty. Can't you see? <laughs> Don't even start that because I will tell them about our secret of uh, uh, Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. So let's please go back to the TV us, show. Yeah, please, right? please. Uh, Bukhe, you want to take us through it? And uh, some of the things we spoke about. Sure, we spoke about a lot of things. And the reason why we have Zazie where the story continues is also because, you know, there isn't enough time yes. on TV. Mm. So some, a, a lot of the content. <gasps> has to be cut out of the show yeah. Yeah. Uh, so this is a continuation of our conversation sure. on TV uh, we spoke about your fashion label yes, yes. Um, to take us take us through some of the things that you didn't see on the show that you were hoping would be there uh, okay. like there's just so much to you that's the thing yeah it means so much to me it's still my baby so I say we're in fifth stage at the moment you know um, Groshe is my clan name, this is Dugosam. Mm. So I want to pay tribute to my forefathers, you know, mm. and just put put a tag in it, mm. you know, so that the whole world will know about Groshe. Groshe, we make clothes for everyone and everyone from Nala, three year old to, to Magogo, you know. Mm. And I also pay tribute to my aunt Nombulelo, who was a fashionista. I looked after her. Nombulelo, my aunt, um, she passed away, I think, around 2006. Um, she used to inspire. She inspires my dress sense now, you know. Mm. Um, she's what uh, Abandabatal used to call Abum Shoza, you know, where we Banzula, little sisters, mm. you know. So um, my fashion sense is kind of taken from her as well. And all, all, all the women in my life, you know, I, I pay tribute uh, and make these clothes that I make. At the moment, sister say, we're not really under wraps, but we're still we're still busy on production, and we want mm. we want to come out with a bang, mm. you know. And but at the moment we do we do special requests here and there, you know. Mm. But Gayo is just a, clo a clothing brand that represent every shape, and every every style. You know, there are people that are out there and they don't feel comfortable in their skins and they don't feel comfortable in their bodies. Yeah. So our clothes um, are there to to build that confidence in a woman, in a man, in a child and everyone else who wishes to, to, to be different. Mm. Because as you can see, my, my, my dress sense also is like, oh, all right, brilliant. Like, you know, but it's comfortable for me and I feel confident. Mm. Uh, with what I'm wearing, so I want to create that platform for Avanti as well. So that is why we decided on. I decided on the Yeah, and it's not all right with Gogen. It's that is so interesting. Yes. Mm. How did yes. you think of that? Yes. I want that too. But my partner, uh okay, she's special. So I want to create. <laughs> I want to create th th that sense in people when you walk into a room and say, mm, "That must be gosh." Yeah. Yeah. Also on the show, Amon, mm. um, another part that was edited out. Uh, we spoke about you know the one of well, well one of the events that took place that completely changed her view on life, mm -hmm. yeah? mm. and that was the passing of of your cousin. Yeah. Nah. You can call him my brother. We Your were brother so close, you know. That, you, yeah. Thank you, thank you, Mpumalelo. Um, we're so close, and he was such a, a bubbly person, and a, and a, she was like she was sunshine, man. Mm. He was he was he was my sunshine, Mpumalelo, and he just committed suicide without leaving any explanation, you know. But I came to realize that. We, we have burdens as, as, as the youth and growing up in, in, in different uh, situations, you tend to take everything in, you know, and struggle to take it out, you know. Mm. So I realized Gutumbo Melelo, he, he had so many things that were bottled in and no one could understand him. Because now our parents call us the lost generation in English. Mm, mm. It's because we express ourselves in different ways. Mm. And whenever that happens, our parents will start saying, no, we are not drugs. Oh no, it's these friends of yours. Um, that's why you're being rebellious. That's why you're being promiscuous. Or that's why you're being what and what, you know. But at the end of the day, you might, they, I think it's important for parents to sit down with your children and just have a conversation about life, you mm. know. How are you taking this and 
what do you think about such and such, you know? But our parents tend to fail us in, 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 in sometimes, you know? Mm. And I, I feel like, not blaming my, 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 my cousin's parents, but I feel like he was suffering from not being understood, and that's a killer itself, yeah. you know? I think he died before he even died, you know? And, and fortunately for me, I, I, I was one of the only people that understood him, you know? And I think what hurt me the most was that I was not there for him at his last hour, you know, and I don't think he wanted me to be there because I was going to convince him otherwise. I yeah. believe. So, um, otherwise, but, how, how would you have known that was the last hour anyway? Yeah, because he, he you know, people who are suicidal hide it so, so good, mm -hmm. you know. You won't tell and just walking by and mm -hmm. say, no, that one's suicidal. Mm. Because they make sure that they don't show mm -hmm. and it doesn't show on their faces when they walk uh, on the streets. Mm -hmm. And you always somehow envy <laughs> their lives. We say, oh, he's having such a good life. But oh, you don't know indeed. that's a disguise yeah. for, for him to just feel better about himself, mm -hmm. you know. So that's what my cousin did and... And, but I forgive him because I later understood because having the gift as well mm -hmm. of, of communicating with, 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 the, with the almost forgotten, mm -hmm. but not forgotten by some, mm -hmm. you know, I, I got to understand why he did it, you know, mm -hmm. and I, I, I came to a point where I forgave him because it was kind of revealed to me why he did mm -hmm. that, you mm -hmm. know, so I'm, I'm, I'm. I'm happy. Mm. I'm happy for him because he he doesn't feel pain now, although he he he, he felt so much pain when he was doing it. Mm. But I know now he's not in pain, yeah. and I make sure Guti he, he has he has a son. Specifically, I think he's like five. Mm -hmm. I make sure Guti spend time with him as well, you know, mm. and he makes it better. Yeah, yeah. he somehow just makes it better. So yeah. yeah. That's, That's the one, man. That's yeah. the one. 1432, wow. we're hanging out with Bushle Bendalo. Mda. Hey, Mda. <laughs> I was waiting for you guys to go, Mda, because I knew. <laughs> no, you, we live in a deep voice. Bushle Bendalo, Mda. Yeah. That deep voice, man. Yeah, yes. That Mda. Amy's only kind of thing. <laughs> hey, <Mda>. man. <laughs> we're hanging out with her, man. We'll give you a chance to chat to her as well a little later on. The Roots, what they do on Metro.